Your Excellency, the President of uh, the Republic of Kenya, Honorable William Ruto, Your Excellency, the Deputy uh, President, Rigati Gachawa, the CS Interior, the PS Interior, Senior Government officials and the heads of uh, the police, prison and the National Youth Service present here, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. On the 21st of, of December 2022, Your Excellency bestowed upon us the responsibility to look into the terms of service of the National uh, Police Service, the Kenya Prison Service, and subsequently, the mandate of the task force was extended to cover the National Youth Service. Eleven months later, I can report, Your Excellency, that uh, the team as uh, that you tasked with this noble responsibility has delivered. On behalf of this team, I want to thank Your Excellency for the honor and the privilege that you gave us to uh, take up this task. Personally, Your Excellency, I thank you for the singular honor that you gave me to lead this task force. The task force was set up to identify the legal, policy, administrative, institutional and operational constraints on the effective service delivery by the National Police Service, the Kenya Prison Service, and the National Youth Service, and to review the welfare and the terms and conditions of service of the members of the three uh, services. In a nutshell, Your Excellency, the task force was asked to examine and review the various aspects that touch on the welfare terms and conditions of service, capabilities, and service delivery, and to additionally identify the key levers for comprehensive change in the services. During the review, it became clear uh, to us, Your Excellency, that, that the, the, the challenges facing the services were not just laws, policies, institutions, and the processes, but also leadership gaps in the services. It also became clear that the reform uh, recommendations stand little chance of being implemented if the leadership issues are not addressed. Initially, and uh, because of the urgency of the issues, you had asked us to this team to complete the exercise within three months. However, because of the depth and the complexity of the issues that emerged from the three services, and the other uh, requirements, such as public participation, consultations, there was a bit of delay, and we want to thank Your Excellency for extending the term uh, to complete this. Your Excellency, to enable uh, it to deliver on its mandate, the team carried out uh, one of the most extensive uh, uh, consultations with the public, pu public participation, in the 47, 47 counties and held sessions with the, the leadership of the three services and the members, the, the junior members of the, of the three services. One of the remarkable recommendations, I mean observations that came from both of the field and the members of the, of the three services is that this time round, uh, the recommendations of the task force would be implemented. There have been similar issues have come up in the previous uh, task forces and they have not been recommended but they trust that this time round your excellency with the commitment that you have given yourself they, they, they are uh, they, they, they don't have any doubt whatsoever that uh, the recommendations will be uh, will be implemented uh, with that your excellency we have made quite a number of, uh, of of recommendations which are in the report I don't want to go into them uh, and we, we have already provided uh, uh, the, 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 the recommendations and uh, it is uh, with that I want to stop there and hand over the report uh, that uh, uh, Your Excellency will uh, uh, then uh, look at the, the implementation. In the report uh, you, you had asked us uh, uh, to, to come up with uh, um, 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 a recommendation, I mean um, an implementation matrix. That's part of the report and the recommendation is that uh, you, you you, you give it to a responsible person 
to, to deal with that and uh, to head that and bring to together all the services under the ministry so that uh, it is implemented. With Thank those you. few remarks, Your Excellency. Yeah. Your Excellency, if you kindly come on stage to receive the report officially. Yes. yes. Uh, for our guests, kindly have a seat. Thank you. With those remarks, Your Excellency, it is now my singular pleasure on behalf of the task force that you set up to hand over the, the report to you. Thank you very much, Your Excellency. I'll kindly ask you to take a seat as now I invite the Deputy President, His Excellency, to make a few remarks and thereafter I invite you to make your remarks.